influencers yet again with Dylan. Hey. Yeah, here we are unboxing the Elgo LCD 3D printer. It's not just the Elgo, it's the Elgo Marks 2. Because 2 is better than 1. So, but yeah. 1 is the loneliest number that there ever was. Uh, so true. So, as you can tell, this one is also Italian and it's like Chile. So we take the sauce out blade to it. Sauce! Why don't you take the razor knife to it? Because it's inside and I don't feel like going in to look for it. Oh, this one pops up. It's a little easier. Hey Justin. Yes. I think there's more terrain in this. Oh my god, this is the whole reason we ordered it, the terrain. Look! <gasps> Destructions. Destructions? We don't need no problem. I'm sorry, but the Dylan is infatuated with the green. Yes, it's it comes green. in two colors. You can get it in red or green. I chose green. I want it to be different. Dylan is still in the green. So we got a box. It's a box. What's it's in the box? It's a toolkit. It's a toolkit. What is in the toolkit? We have funnels for our resin. Oh. We've got all of our screws and bolts and Allen wrenches. Put those aside. We will need those. A measuring cup. What's it's measuring? That's nice. we're measuring the resin, and we get a nice bend over and cock for me. You're not Father Pascal. <laughs> Senpai. We have the scraper, which every 3D printer I've ever ordered comes with. Very nice to have. Love having extra. Of course, we get power supply, and power supply does no good. Oh, I guess it's all in one. Ooh, it's not like the wash station. That is it. That is your power supply, power cord, everything. Thank you, Father Tesla. This, this is the difference. Be one of the differences between version two and version one. This is the rubber gasket that goes around your little base when you put the lid on it to keep fumes from escaping. So very nice. Of course. To help with the COVID, we get free mask. Is COVID already on it? It's from China, I can only hope. We get, oh, I already know what these are. Snip Snips. Ooh, Snips. Never gonna have enough of those. Our USB thumb drive. Very fancy, very nice to have. And then we have our non-metallic scraper. It's cute. It's very nice to have too. Explanations in the video. This is just the unboxing of looking. So, more terrain. More terrain. And more. And more. And then. Uh, oh, it's a cute bundle of joy. So, yeah, again. It's been back. Good seafood oil, you know. You get in the bag, you already know it's gonna be good. Of course, saran wrap for extra protection. They saran wrap for really good. You found a scene. And it probably won't show up on the video, but that's more of an emerald green instead of the teal that's being shown. Um, forest green, if you will. More terrain. I like this terrain already. Look at that. Oh, I'm not looking at the terrain. I'm looking at that build plate. Yes. That is a pretty build plate. And very easy to assemble. I really do like this. 
Of course, you have the wash basin, which is right here. This does need to come off for actual assembly purposes. And recon, you yeah. said that was a wash basin. Don't right. you mean resin right. basin? It, well, technically it is a resin basin. I say it's a wash basin because it's where I will put my figures in. Great. Anyway, it's our nice LCD screen. And that is still a very nice screen, including with the resin basin and a very nice protective step. That is pretty. Now, one thing you might notice with this printer, that they, on the original Elgo Mars, your USB was back here. So there Where's was a, the USB. Well, enough people have wrote in to Elgo and the reviews, and they suggested putting it on point for easier access, and they listened. <gasps> you mean a company that listens? A company that listens. So there we go. And literally, this is a very easy setup for a printer. Literally, you will screw that onto there. You will loosen these two screws so this drops all the way down. The zero with a piece of paper under it. Tighten, tighten, pull it, send it back up. For your resident, do the test print that comes on your printer. Probably one of the easiest setups for a 3D printer I have ever seen. And we will get that video to you shortly. Yes. So, here's the unboxing. There will be a link below to the setup video. And of course, there will also be a link to the Mercury Curing Station, which is something nice to have. So, until next time, stay tuned.